Welcome to the Options Beginner Series again. In this course, we are going to sell a call option. Selling a call option is also called as short calls. And we are going to use GLD. GLD is an ETF. It's the gold ETF. It's one of the largest ETFs uh, in the market. And we're going to use GLD as the example for a short call. In this course, we are going to look at the basic strategy of selling a call. So when we are selling a call, we are opposite of a call buyer. If we are selling a call, we must be bearish. So the GLD is the gold ETF and it trades for approximately one tenth of the gold price. So it had a high of 174 a couple of months ago. And you can see that the gold gold ETF uh, is about one tenth of the gold futures. The gold futures are actually slash GC. So if we see a slash GC, uh, gold is trading at about 1641 and the gold ETF is trading for about 159 or 160. So it's not exactly one tenth, but it's very close to it. If you look at the GLD chart, you can see that it's on a downtrend. So it's been going up and down for the past month or so, but it's had a high of uh, 174 and then this was a very strong move to the downside on uh, Feb 29. So since that move, it's never really come back and tried to uh, go through that again. Even if gold goes up a little bit, it's probably going to face some resistance right here. This was and also over here, you can see some, uh, again, some volume here. Actually, this was more of a support volume, temporary support. But uh, this is a fairly decent sized down bar again. So my sense is even if GLD tries to go up, it's probably not going to go much uh, higher than maybe 162 or 163. So when we are selling a call, we are bearish, but we also have to bear in mind we have to put probability on our side. So I want to be able to sell something at the 165 or 166 level that gives me this much room for the, for, for, for the GLD ETF. Even if it starts going up, I don't expect it to go up beyond 165 or 166. So if I sell my short call here at this level, 166, there's a lot of resistance. And there's been some selling pressure on this particular bar at 163. So even if gold tries to go up, I, it'll be difficult for gold to move past this point. So by putting our short call at 165 or 166, we are actually taking a fairly safe uh, trade.